So uh, we are back, and now I am on to Book How. This is Book How here, and um, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a KDP cover generator. So um, let's say hypothetically we want the width to be nine. We want this to be. I guess, no, the height's nine and the width, no, it, yeah, no, it's six. And we want the paper to be white. We want the page count is going to be a hundred. And, um, as well. And, uh, this should go as well. And, uh, here's the thing. Um, it will put a barcode right where it needs to be. So you can do optional barcode in US to $24. Now all we have to do is type in our email address and I'm actually just gonna do at gmail.com here. And I'm gonna do Dot com consent email to check this to confirm you want us to email you um, we're just gonna oh yeah yeah we have to yeah that's mandated as well you can also generate a barcode here and um, as well and now we email the code template thank you for choosing book how now, um, maybe next time, please just email me the template. Yeah, so you don't need that at all. Okay, and we're going to wait for that to come into our email. There it is. And voila. And you get a PDF guide of that. You get three attachments and you get a little video as well. I'm gonna open this to show you. And this is a .png. Um, you're gonna need to actually use the uh, PDF, but just one moment. Okay, and then there's this, and then there's the height. Um, okay, yeah, so this is the sample. So it's horizontally going nine inches, and then uh, vertically it'll go six, about. That's what I put in. That's... And, uh, and here's the PDF guide. And you're gonna use this in Canva for your guide. So just be sure to type in inches depending on what you are doing. Um, actually, you know what? I'm gonna pull pages up real quickly. Barcode locations and size, that's two inches by 1.2 inches. Turn off temp, yeah, that's right. Okay, and we're gonna open this. And give that a moment. We're gonna actually go back to Book Cow real quickly. And I'm actually gonna show you how to do this based on your guides. Um, just give me a moment and also I'm going to quit zoom yeah yeah and uh, this is LibreOffice which I'm in too I'm actually gonna quit this real quickly if it gives me okay good there All right if I could get insert text zoom view
help um, measure documents show ruler guide okay so this is going to be eight inches wide um apparently uh that's what the book will be um but the height um i know you show ruler guide Go to, and then you can, uh, yeah, so you have this um, for your width and uh, as well. Hmm. I can just find it. Roller. Yeah, so you can definitely add this. Um, so we have eight inches there. Actually, I'm gonna see if I can bring up LibreOffice as well. And I also recommend you use that, but it looks like we're gonna be eight, but the height, let me see if I could also pull back up the uh, other one. Yeah. Yeah, the width is that, so the height's got to be eight. So, um, yeah, if the width is eight, or yeah, it's eight, and then I think the height would be, yeah, the height would still be 11 that you're operating in. So that's just the standard eight by 11 and a half. Um, yeah. Yeah, you can still do, um, let's see, we can open up, actually do a recent one here. Give that a moment. Okay. So um, we're gonna do this and we can actually set this. I'm gonna set this up to about, um, six inches here. A little more. We're actually, hold up, undo, undo, undo. Okay. All right, we're gonna do this, we're gonna do, and then we're gonna come here and we're gonna do command shift down. And I'm gonna take this bad boy, we're gonna move this here. Okay, all that. And I guess we'll go about here. So now we have something uh, at about six inches. I say just go to six and a half um, and your height. Ruler. Alert. All right, view and then rulers. Vertical ruler. Okay. So we're going to go back to book cow real quickly. Um, 
And I say we do, it's still six and a half by 11, but I say you can, but if it's, yeah, if the whiff is that, um, yeah, I say just, yeah, just make it nine. Yeah, just make it, I say just, you could do about eight and a half, just give yourself a little wiggle room. Uh, with that at first, um, as well, and I'll show you how to, uh, format this, yeah, 6.5 is our width, and you'll see this if you're working in 8.5, but I'm working with something that is 50 pages, and I will email myself the cover template. Yeah, and you may not get this on your first try, but that's absolutely fine. But but this is your guide um, for what you want. Um, no. Okay, and then there's the new email as well. Okay, and, and let me just open this just to show you. Okay, and this looks something like what we're gonna need and and I'll show you how to work this with Kindle Create and Microsoft Word, but uh, just go there. I'll leave a link for bookcow.com. And, uh, and with that being said, um, I'll see you all in the next video.